I also want to talk, obviously, uh, your parents, uh, if, if you're bringing them to the award shows, they've obviously were very supportive over the years. You uh, grew up in Texas before you moved to Nashville. And is, uh, did you get your start doing county fairs? Is that uh, something that is, sounds cliche, but is also true? No, that's a real thing. Um, there's, <laughs> like, I, I mean, that's one of the good ones. So that was a good gig if you got a county fair. Um, I've <laughs> What's played... a bad gig? Yeah. Like, a parking lot playing on a bale of hay. <laughs> <laughs> so. See, that's what I feel like somebody like me living in New York would think people would do in the South, and now you're telling me it's that's true. That's actually really true. It yeah. would be like an SNL skit. To yeah. You, but it was So real you life. just get a call and you're like, a bale of hay? <laughs> Where? The parking lot? I'm there. <laughs> you're not paying me? Cool. <laughs> and yeah. what, were, uh, what were those audiences like when you were doing a parking lot show? Um, not listening? Yeah. <laughs> You auditioned, this is incredible, you auditioned for both The Voice and American Idol. And oh, more than that. Oh, you, so you did a lot of these shows. Oh, my God, yeah. Like, everything you can think of, America's Got Talent, American Idol, Star Search, when that was a thing. <laughs> um, yeah, The Voice, all of it, and it was all a no. <laughs> Just a hard, did you ever get to even the second tier of any of those? Not really. I have this like very traumatic, vivid memory of auditioning for American Idol when I was 17 in Dallas, where I'm from, and it was at the Cowboys Stadium. And you know, you don't see, you know, Paula and Simon and Randy in the first go audition. It's like a stadium cattle call, and you audition for like a 20-year-old producer who has like probably no music cred. <laughs> <laughs> you just sing for like eight seconds and sing your heart out, and then um, my entire group got cut, and they were like, sorry, you have to take the walk of shame. <laughs> and um, yeah, I just remember being like 17, and I had to like walk through the walk of shame out to the parking lot and like find my mom's car and just cry on the way home with her. Um, but I mean, it all worked out. Yeah, it did all work out. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that 20 year old right now is watching this being like, oh no. Yeah. I passed on her? Uh, no, I know, right? Yeah. I, but honestly, like, the poetic justice of that whole thing is that now people, like, audition with my songs on those shows. Yeah. So I just get the check in the mail. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Cast that check. <laughs> <laughs>